हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू आवर चैनल इंस्पायरिंग माइंड दिस इज द सेकेंड पार्ट ऑफ व्हाट इज द वेटेज ऑफ केमिस्ट्री फॉर द नीट एग्जाम इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द इम्पोर्टेंट चैप्टर्स ऑफ इनऑर्गेनिक केमिस्ट्री एंड वी विल आल्सो डिस्कस द मार्क्स डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन फॉर दीज चैप्टर्स बाय नाउ वी ऑल नो दैट chemistry comprises of 180 marks and as we have discussed previously approximately all parts of chemistry have equal weightage that is 60 marks so inorganic chemistry also holds a weightage of 60 marks if you have not watched the first part of this video then there is a link in the description below so now first look at what are the important topics of inorganic chemistry the important topics are coordination compound periodic property chemical bonding p block and d block elements now if you prepare these topics these topics are going to cover 50% of your inorganic chemistry according to the marks distribution so if there is a student who has not prepared their inorganic chemistry so they can focus on these topics and that will surely fetch them some good marks during the neat exam so now let's discuss the marks distribution of our first topic that is chemical bonding in the year aipmd 2014 2015 neat 2016 phase 1 and neat 2016 phase 2 the weightage was 16 marks while in aipmd 2013 the weightage was 8 marks now let's move to our next topic p block elements this is also a very important topic as i said in aipmd 2014 the weightage for this chapter was 32 marks while in neat 2016 phase 1 the weightage reduced to 16 marks in neat 2016 phase 2 it further reduced to 12 marks in aipmd 2015 the weightage was 8 marks and in aipmd 2013 the weightage was 4 marks now let's move to our next topic coordination compound In AIPMD 2013 the weightage was 8 marks the weightage was 8 marks in AIPMD 2014 AIPMD 2015 and NEET 2016 phase 2 while in NEET 2016 phase 1 the weightage was 4 marks which brings us to our next topic d block elements in AIPMD 2013 AIPMD 2014 AIPMD 2015 the weightage was 8 marks In NEET 2016 Phase One and NEET 2016 Phase Two, the weightage was four marks. Which brings us to our next topic, metallurgy. This is the easiest topic. In AIPMD 2013 and 2014, no questions were asked from this chapter. In AIPMD 2015, NEET 2016 Phase One and NEET 2016 Phase Two, the weightage was four marks. Now let's move to one of the important topics, which is periodic property. In AIPMD 2013. The weightage for this chapter was four mark, which reduced to zero marks in AIPMD 2014. In that year, no questions were asked from this chapter. In AIPMD 2015, four marks of questions were asked from this chapter. In NEET 2016 Phase One, twelve marks of questions were asked from this chapter, and in NEET 2016 Phase Two, the weightage for this chapter was eight marks. Which brings us to our next topic, S block element. In AIPMD 2013, the weightage for this chapter was eight marks. While in AIPMD 2014 and NEET 2016 Phase One, no questions were asked from this chapter. In AIPMD 2015 and NEET 2016 Phase Two, the weightage for this chapter was eight marks. Which brings us to our next topic, F block element. In AIPMD 2014, four marks of questions were asked from this chapter. While in all other years. No questions were asked from this chapter which brings us to our next topic environmental chemistry in AIPMD 2013 four marks of questions were asked from this chapter while in all other years no questions were asked from this chapter that brings us to our next topic hydrogen and its compound in AIPMD 2013 eight marks of questions were asked from this chapter which reduced to 4 marks in NEET 2016 phase 1 while in all other years no questions were asked from this chapter which brings us to our next topic qualitative analysis in AIPMD 2013 and in AIPMD 2014 eight marks of questions 
were asked from this chapter while in all other years no questions were asked from this chapter so to conclude this video i want to say that student must be strong in chapters like chemical bonding which helps in both organic and inorganic chemistry and from the neat point of view chemical bonding is also important as it can be observed that every year minimum four questions are asked from chemical bonding so if a student wants to score good mark in the neat exam then he or she must prepare this chapter very thoroughly followed by p block element once you finish these two chapters then you move to d block element then you move to coordination compound and finally you finish f block element once you are done with these chapters then all other chapters are simple and they are very easy to revise and score so i think this is the analysis for inorganic chemistry and discussion of mark distribution for inorganic chemistry i hope you like this video and if you like this video then please share this video with your friends and who have not watched the previous part of this video please click click in the description box for the link for the first part of this video and uh, share this video with your friends and family and if you have not yet subscribed to our channel then please subscribe and i will be making more such videos for you in the future too see you guys take care